Well, welcome back to Fiesta Foods Sizzling Recipes. As you can see, I'm holding the meat that has slow cooked. It was boiled for two hours with some really incredible seasoning. As Veronica mentioned, if you want to use a crock pot, it would take about four hours. So really a great meal if you're working all day and maybe you want to stop home during your lunch break and get dinner cooked for you while you're working. So there's a lot of things that you can do with barbacoa, but today we're going to make tacos. So make Veronica that. is um, warming up some tortillas and a little olive oil right there. Yes. And then we're going to make some tacos. You can use this meat like a main dish. You know, you can put the barbacoa, rice, beans, or a side of lettuce mm -hmm. and, you know, a salad. But uh, we're going to be making tacos right now because it's fun. It's good. And we can eat one each. So. Now, now, something else I can make you, uh, let you know about also is that normally, traditionally, barbacoa is made with lamb, with sheep. But mm -hmm. uh, today we made it with beef. So there are, you have some liberties that you can take with this. And where did you say that this is really traditional? Did you say Guadalajara? Guadalajara is the, it's, okay. it's a very unique item for me, Guadalajara. But in other places like Michoacan and many other places makes it too. All right, so, do, can I squeeze some lime on here? Just put your meat and then the lime, you can put it on top. I mean, she's, making, I like she's always making her own tacos, her own <laughs> recipes, something she has to do different than what I always say. <laughs> Veronica's so amazing now, and I've learned from the best. Now, we're running out of time here, okay. but we've got some beautiful, beautiful finished product right there, so you can take a look and see what it looks like. Okay, this and is the way you do it. You put okay. the lettuce. I mean... That's not lettuce. No. Onion and cilantro. I threw don't her off. listen to me. You see, that's why she does it. That's why I don't listen. No, yeah. I'm kidding. I'm <laughs> kidding. No, she's amazing. If you want to make this for yourself today or, you know, for dinner tonight, you can log on to FiestaFoodSupermarkets.com. This is my favorite, the green salsa there. And the recipe, the directions, everything is right there for you to try out this recipe at home. So easy. Really, I mean, I think this is probably one of the simplest recipes that we made in quite a while. Yes. And if it's good, I'll tell you in a second. But it's really good. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm As always, Veronica's right. It's really good. Okay. Definitely give this a shot. You didn't say salut. Oh, hold on. This is our unique presentation. Salud. Salud. Cheers. <laughs> All right, back to you guys. Mm. Hey, cut.